uh, how exactly we are going to use our numbers or our analytical skills uh, in the field of medical science or research basically clinical research and medical research so there is uh, broadly two main types of clinical study one is called the experimental study and other is the observational uh and why is all that that will i will let you know so uh, observational study have four main sub topics cohort case control cross sectional and ecological experimental study have one main major part is called as a randomized control trial most important type in this is a cohort study okay so what is a cohort so cohort study is a basically a study that happens in a longitudinal manner that it happens over a long period of a time and cohort studies are actually the most expensive studies because collecting that type of data storing that data managing and maintaining that data is a very very difficult after deciding your study design the first thing you do is you try to find a sample size okay then you get a sample size and after getting a let's say i have a 200 sample size now so what i'll do is i'll divide my sample into 100 to 100 okay for uh, let's say you know that type of uh, milkshake Uh, that says that uh, if you take that milkshake or like if you uh, eat that powder with a water of milk, it will reduce your weight. Okay. So let's say we are uh, we are testing that whether that milkshake works or not. So uh, for that milkshake, I take a hundred kg. This and I give that. So, so my case means uh, the patient or a participant I'm actually uh, applying or giving my treatment. Okay. So those are that hundred that I'm using as a case. And then what I do for a control? So control means uh, whether in a case control study, basically what you do is you compare the two groups. 